remind board members and other speakers to speak into the microphone so that the recorder will pick up the sound for the minutes. This is critical to ensure that minutes can be transcribed without leaving out important information. The Office of General Counsel has provided the full Board Educator Licensure Committee members all documentation relating to each matter in advance of today's committee meeting. Documentation presented to the members for review for the different types of cases may consist of investigative files, procedural evidence, transcripts, reports and recommendations, memoranda, district communications, and communications from educators. Is there any objection to the full board educator licensure committee going into executive session to discuss the educator licensure matters that have been prepared to present today? No. Hearing none, I declare the educator licensure committee in executive session. Entertain a motion regarding item number one. Mr. Chair, I move that the state. Wait, wait. Oh, so he is going to let us know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So they promised. I move that the State Board of Education suspend the certificate of Lawanda B. Jackson, certificate 193. 931 commencing on August 13th, 2024 and ending on February 12th, 2025 and approve the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. All right, we have a motion. Is there a second? Second. Thank you. We have a second from, I think, Ms. Kriminger. Yes. Um, any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor indicate by saying aye. 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 Thank you. <laughs> Uh, the committee will now entertain a motion regarding item number two. I move that the State Board of Education revoke the certificate of Danny Shelton, certificate number 301118, effective August 13th, 2024, and approve the order of revocation on the grounds of unprofessional conduct. We do now have a motion. Is there a second? Second. Second by uh, Vice Chair Ms. Allison. Um, any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor indicate by saying aye. 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 All right, the motion carries. I would like to recognize at this time Ms. Kreminger for a report from the ELC subcommittee. Thank you, Mr. Chair. I got it right finally after six months. <laughs> I move that the State Board of Education ratify the actions of the Educator Licensure Committee for these cases. The State Board of Education denies the application of Donna Hobbs for certification. The State Board of Education approves the application of Stefan Kinsley for certification. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Rebecca Emmy Andango, certificate 187641, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2026, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Kelsey Jean Carlson, Certificate 268804, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Stephanie Coombs, Certificate 301530, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Amy J. Crutchfield, Certificate 191536, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Joseph Francis Galinsky, Certificate 258672, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education appeals the certificate of Stacy Leonard Green, Certificate 287794, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. 
The State Board of Education suspends certificate of Joshua Kyle Hall, certificate 271120, commencing on August 13th, 2024, and ending on August 12th, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Roland Porter Hughes, certificate 187992, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Elizabeth Nicole Kelso, certificate 301986, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Sean Lee Metzer, certificate 264020, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Whitney Aaron Brooke Penland, certificate 279543, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Kristen Elzer Prater, certificate 314140, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. The State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Marie K. Van Romberg, certificate 300018, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. And the State Board of Education suspends the certificate of Bradley C. Willingham, certificate 228725, commencing on August 13, 2024, and ending on August 12, 2025, and approves the order of suspension on the grounds of unprofessional conduct for breach of contract. Thank you very much, Ms. Creminger. That was very, very well done. The committee will now entertain a motion to ratify the actions from the Educator Licensure Subcommittee from earlier today. Mr. Chair, I believe there was uh, one error in the way uh, that was typed and read. Oh, well, please uh, help me. Case number three, uh, it says ending in 2026. That would be two years, and that's beyond our ability. Isn't that right? So that's an unprofessional conduct case. Breach of contract cases are the ones oh, where okay. the statutory penalty is capped at one year. For unprofessional conduct cases, the board I has. Stand corrected. Thank yep. you. No, no, and I, I appreciate that, but that was, that was good, and there are those, and I guess if, if we have a, a motion to ratify and a second, then we could ask questions. I mean, just because there is that distinction between un, un, um, breach of contract, unprofessional conduct for breach of contract, and some with just unprofessional conduct. And for those of us who aren't necessarily a part of that, there's just a distinction. That's handled by them. We're just trusting that, that that's been done. Okay. And I, I, I get it. And that's the two years thing. I'm wrong. <laughs> All right. Um, again, do we have a motion to ratify the actions from the Educator Licensure Committee? I'll so move. All right. Thank you very much, uh, Vice Chair. Allison, do we have a second? I second. Thank you very much. Um, all in favor, indicate by saying aye. 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 Any indication otherwise? All right. Uh, thank you very much. Is there a motion to adjourn? So what, move. Do I have a second? second? All in favor, indicate by saying aye. 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 Let's go eat. Mm-hmm.